so now uh, let us start with the uh, next part that is the kotlin fundamentals okay so i'll search for the kotlin compilers at first we'll start with the online compiler so you can search for this kotlin play.kotlin.org okay you can practice kotlin over here this is the online compiler for kotlin okay so if you are familiar with any programming language especially java okay why because syntax of kotlin is very much similar as compared to java and it is very short and crisp okay when it comes to programming language syntax like in java we have we have we have to write a lots of boilerplate code and in java we have to write lengthy code okay i should say a lengthy code in java but when it comes to kotlin the code becomes very short okay the length of the code becomes short when it comes to kotlin so kotlin is easy to understand when it syntax wise okay as compared to java so let us start with basics of kotlin so at first i'll start with if you want to bring any print anything on the screen how can you do that okay if you are working with java you have you write system.out.println and if you are working with kotlin you write uh, so what do you write okay if you are working with c++ you write c out okay for kotlin just write println okay if you are working with java you have to write system.out.println but see in kotlin it is very short just println println and the statement so for example if you want to print hello or your name okay let me print my name so i can print that on the screen only single bracket okay we will be printing everything in this main function only as of now so as you can see my name is getting printed on the screen with the help of this println statement okay so this is how i can print anything if i want to print hello world Okay, this is how I can print hello world on my screen. Okay. So this is the basic print statement in Kotlin. Okay. So with the help of print print ln statement, okay. If you want print if you want to print anything line by line, you can do it via this print ln statement. But if you but what if if you want to print everything in a single line? So for this, for that, instead of print ln, just write print. Okay, with the help of this, you can print everything on a single line. Okay, if you want, you can add space over here after this. Okay, so this is how you can print with the help of only print statement. Okay, with the help of print statement, you can print everything on a single line. But if I add print ln, everything will be printed on next line. So that is the difference between print and print ln. Okay, so this is the first thing that we have learned in Kotlin language. I think this is clear to everyone, and now let us see how we can declare variables okay and what are variables how we can declare variables in kotlin and how we can use them 